we have a new plane that we designed and this plane is a little bit different it has a v-tail with two, only two flaps no rudder no ailerons down here and it has a virtual rudder and that works like this So like if I want to go left, I would do this. If I want to go right, I would do this. And then it's got elevator and ailerons like usual. And of course we have the throttle, but I'm not going to rev it up with it aimed at his face. Oh, I hope not. <laughs> and this is actually an SU... Yeah, it's an SU-26 modified with, for a V-tail. Okay. And it's number two. <laughs> yeah. This is the first model in it with a few revisions in structure. Like we have a, a barbecue skewer right there. And we added some reinforcing packing tape here and here to reinforce these pieces. And then we have uh, more of that here to reinforce the hinges because they were kind of weak and was floppy. Another revision we added is plastic stick and two straws to strengthen these rods a little bit. But it flies pretty good except it doesn't like the wind because this foam is too lightweight. So we're planning on building another version of it and when we get that done we might run another test fly. Okay, let's rev it up and, and show them the power it has. Yeah. All right. Whoa, I mean, that was powerful. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> what? <laughs> Wasn't that powerful. Oh, and this is, a, this is the, uh, it's a proto. Yeah. It's a prot. It's made out of that blue foam board. Yeah. Really light. Yeah. Too light. That's why we're building another one out of the craft type foam board. It's heavier than the combat planes. Next. Anyway, so keep an eye on the channel because we might have another video of a new version of the same plane with better foam coming up. And might have a flight too. Yeah. So. That's all for today. We'll see you on the tube. Don't forget to subscribe.